Welcome to the channel. In this tutorial, we'll share three essential curves adjustment layer tricks you need to know as a Photoshop beginner. Let's jump right in. Number 1. Reviving Faded Photos In this photo of this guy, we have a tree that doesn't look very vibrant. Let's enhance its color with a hue saturation layer. So, I'll increase the saturation. But as you can see, the colors are not improving as much as we expect. Even if I increase it all the way, you can see that the result gets much worse. What we should do is create a curves adjustment layer. First, go to the green channel. Take the mid-tones of the green channel and slightly increase them. Select the red channel and increase the mid-tones slightly. Then, go to the blue channel and decrease the mid-tones a bit. Create a vibrance layer and increase the vibrance to enhance the color tone you've created. Create another curves adjustment layer. Go to the green channel and, this time, increase the highlights. By adding a control point, keep the shadows and mid-tones in place. This way, you've only increased the highlights. Go to the blue channel and decrease the highlights doing the same steps. Select all the layers and group them. Then, select the background layer and use the object selection tool to select the object in the photo. Now, select the group, hold down the Alt button, and click on the layer mask icon to fill the selection with black. Decrease the density a bit to reduce the effect of the mask. Create another curves adjustment layer and apply a regular contrast. Finally, go back to the group, select the first curves adjustment layer, and lower its opacity. Then gradually increase it until you're satisfied. And this is the result. Number 2. Maintaining color consistency. You've probably experienced that when you try to change the light of an image using a curves adjustment layer, not only the light but also the color changes. Like this image of the sky, as you can see, we've created contrast using the curves adjustment, but the color of the image has increased significantly, and the hue might even change. All you need to do is set the blending mode of the curves layer to luminosity. As you can see, now only the light changes are applied to the image, and no color changes occur. Number 3. Restoring dark areas of the image. In this example, we want to restore the very dark parts of the image that have lost their details. What you need to do is very simple. Just create a curves adjustment layer. Then, add a control point in the shadows area. Raise it while observing the dark parts of the image. When you're satisfied, create another control point, but this time in the highlights area. Reduce the highlights that were increased. By doing this, you've kept the details in the highlights, and brought back the lost details in the shadows. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video.